This is the installation video of the Laverne Grip Steps on a 2016 Freightliner Sprinter Worker Cargo Van. The 400744 bracket kit is required to complete this install. These steps are available in a black powder coat finish. Make sure you have the tools needed to complete this installation. On the passenger side, measure and locate the five mounting locations along the bottom edge of the body. The driver's side will use only the front two mounting points. Before you start the installation, pre-assemble the brackets. Insert a zinc plated 5 16 inch bolt with flat washer through the back of the mounting bracket and slide the spacer bracket over the bolt. Loosely fasten the brackets together with a serrated flange hex nut. Repeat this for all the brackets. Begin the installation on the driver's side. If you do not have rear AC, measure back 9.5 inches from the back of the mud flap and remove the factory plug on the body panel. Next, measure over a half inch from the edge of the body plug hole and make a mark for drilling. Using a center punch, make a mark on the panel to prevent the drill bit from wandering. You may need to trim off some of the underbody coating to get a better punch. With a 7 16 inch bit, drill at the marked location. Next, insert a 5 16 inch U-nut into the body panel. Lift the bracket into place and fasten with a zinc plated 5 16 inch bolt with flat washer into the top slot of the bracket. With the bracket in place, use the lower mount bracket as a guide and drill the pinch weld with an 11 32 inch bit. Temporarily insert a bolt into the first hole to help with drilling the second location. When the drilling is done, insert a black 5 16 inch bolt with flat washer into each hole. On the back side, place a retainer plate over both bolts and fasten with a serrated flange nut. With the hardware assembled, tighten only the bolts on the pinch weld at this time. If the truck does have rear AC, attach the brackets using the same method as the rear bracket. To attach the rear bracket, measure about 27 and inches back from the front of the mud flap. Once again, you may need to cut off some of the underbody coating to allow the bracket to sit flush against the body. Measure the height of the first bracket from the top of the bracket to the bottom of the floorboard. Next, lift the rear bracket onto the body panel, match the height from the front bracket, and make a mark. Use a center punch at the marked location and drill using a 7 32 inch bit. Lift the bracket into place and fasten with the supplied self-tapping screw. Do not fully tighten at this time. Repeat the steps on the pinch weld as done on the front bracket. For the passenger side, install the first two brackets as done with the driver side. To locate the third bracket location, measure back 48 and a half inches, remove the body plug, and scrape away any excess underbody coating. Once again, measure and mark one half inches back where you will need to drill for inserting the U-nut. Lift the bracket into place and attach with a 5 16 inch bolt and flat washer. Drill the holes on the pinch weld just as done with the other brackets. To finish installing the brackets, measure back 68 and half inches and 88 and half inches for the remaining mounting locations and repeat the installation process. Before attaching the grip steps to the brackets, slide the end cap over the front of one of the steps. Mark the location for each attachment hole. Remove the end cap and drill pilot holes where previously marked. Replace the end cap and use the provided self-tapping screws to attach the cap to the bottom of the step. Repeat this process for all end caps. Lift the grip step into position and set on top of the mounting brackets. Insert a flat spacer plate between the bracket and the board. Slide a support brace into the channel of the step over the mounting bracket. Insert two 5 16 inch carriage bolts down through the support brace, spacer, and bracket. Fasten the hardware with 5 16 inch washers and flange nuts. Repeat this process with all mounting brackets. 
Adjust the grip step into your desired location. Once satisfied with the placement, torque the hardware to the values listed in the instruction sheet. Repeat this process on the other side. This completes the installation of the Laverne Grip Steps on a 2016 Sprinter Worker Cargo Van. For more information on this and other great products, visit LavernTruck.com.